Hey everybody, it's Blah Blah Peas, and welcome back to some more Super Mario Maker. In this episode, we're gonna start going through my friend PK Sparks' levels. Now, before I begin, I've said this before, but I wanna just restate it. Uh, I have played half of his levels before, uh, most of which were, actually no, all of these were uh, for recordings on his channel. It's just, I think, Swim on Wayward Sun wasn't uploaded because of technical difficulties. Um, the others I believe are on his channel, but even though I've already played through them I'm gonna go ahead and do all of them for my own channel and then I'm gonna start taking uh, Suggestions again as based on the comments from the previous uh, couple of videos and any that anybody leaves uh, from here on out so I'll probably end up doing this three and three so uh, Three videos this I'm sorry three levels this video three levels the next video so we're gonna start from oldest to newest bowser's inferno and here's the thing this has less than a one percent completion rate but i actually beat this level way back on the media copy when uh we first got the game but apparently things have really changed and i don't know how badly they've changed really so we're kind of just gonna see how this goes uh the beginning seems more or less the same uh, I do remember that you had to throw this in there and have them explode, but apparently now there's two fire sticks, which makes it a little more annoying. So as soon as they go up, all right, run through. Okay, not so bad. But PK is one of those developers that rewards you for exploring, basically. So, oh, shoot. Um, I don't remember that being up there. <laughs> Okay, so yeah, uh, PK is one of those uh, kind of developers that reward you for exploring. So if you look around, you'll probably find uh, some hidden stuff. But it's not really like I thought I had like one more second. Oops. But it's not anything like cheap or unfair. It's like if you go somewhere, eventually there'll be. Can I land on the? I keep thinking I have one more second before the bomb explodes. All right, let's actually land on the trampoline. There we go. That makes things a lot easier, don't you think? Oh, shoot, he jumps high. <sighs> I gotta relearn bomb physics, jeez. Okay. It's, you notice how little trouble I had the first time, but now it's just like the worst thing ever. All right, also if the fire sticks hit them, they start going off immediately. Oh, come on go 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 okay free mushroom and now that i know there's a freaking hammer bro up there i can be a little more careful yeah i don't like that I, I don't like there being a wrench guy like right there i can't get up there can i huh maybe you just can't get up here anymore i'm pretty sure that's how you used to be able to uh go get a star but apparently that has changed Okay, okay. Oh, stupid hammers. Go, 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 go. That was gonna be. A oh. Yeah. Oh, wait. Here's something. That looks a little too suspicious, don't you think? Come on. There we go. Oh, and I could probably kill Bowser by spin jump. Oh, oh. Go, go. Just go. Just go. I can't do that anymore. Are you ki Oh. You've gotta be kidding me. Come on, PK. Why'd you change the level up so much? I played through like two different versions of this level and he changed it so much that knowing what he used to have is actually making it worse for me. I didn't think that actually be possible. All right, let's go. So the beginning's not too bad. I think it's just there are two fire sticks instead of one. There probably used to just be one. But um, all right, let's actually kill this guy this time. And let's try to get up there again. I'm pretty sure you can. All right, come on, get up there. No, he changed it. He specifically left it like that for people who did remember it. That kind of sucks. That's a little jerkish. Oh, come on. No, 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 mm, did not mean to do that. Did not mean to do that. Okay. So let's actually try to kill Bowser. Oh, come on, stupid fireballs are oh, eating my fireballs. Okay, he's gonna fly. Okay, no problem. And in here, don't even worry about killing Bowser, just go through. I mean, I was going to, but, oh shoot. Didn't mean to do that. 
All right, let's get up there. Okay. Mm. There'd be, there'd be something good up here. Those are booze. That is not good. This has to be good, though. Stars. Thank you. Come on. How far do I go? How far do I go? Oh, jeez. I'm breaking the level. Well, it's not really breaking if it's designed this way. Um, okay. Uh, I only get this one fireball, though. Okay. And cool thing, you keep getting these, and they can go through the fire. <gasps> oh, jeez, no. Wait, wait a minute. All right, can I break the course with you? Again, it's not really breaking if uh, it's designed. Nope. I hate you, PK. I hate you. Why'd you do this? Why did you do this, PK? Come on, I need to keep hitting him with beetles now, or I'm screwed. Bowser's Inferno. Why? Why you changed so much? It was actually possible to like really easily beat this with stars uh, the first time, which is what I just kind of took advantage of. And like PK always says, like you're, you're rewarded for exploring. It's not like you need anything to beat the level. It just makes it easier. I want to say, hmm, I want to say he actually beat the level without using the help, uh, just to make sure that it was actually beatable. Uh, I'm not entirely sure about that. Don't quote me on that. I haven't asked him recently. I probably could or should, but whatever the case. All right. As soon as these go through again, go. Okay. So don't go up top because it's useless. Uh, be careful about these guys. As long as I stay in the air. Okay. There we go. Now we're fine. As long as I stay in the air for this hammer, bro. <sighs> I hate you. I really hate you. Go, 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 go. Okay. If Shoot. No. Oh, right. You can't. He bounces off. Okay. Where's that? Wait. Fire flower. Thank you. See, this time the fire flowers come out the pipe. So... You could just keep replenishing them. You actually could uh, kill Bowser and just keep getting uh, the fireballs back so that it's way easier to get through this. Uh, so, hmm, should I have? Uh, oh, come on. Okay, well, I'm gonna get another fire flower by the time I get this done anyway, so. Just spin jump to infinity and go. Just go. And here you don't really have to jump, just, there we go. Go, 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 go. Hit him. Oh, you've got to be kidding me. And there's the axe. So I can just jump over, take the hit. Boom. Okay. So there's Bowser's Inferno. If you get that star, it's really easy. Still surprised that it's a 1% completion rate, though. Or less than, actually. This actually isn't one of his worst levels. As far as difficulty goes, that is. 40 minutes? Come on, DBZ Flips. That took me less than eight. All right, fun and absolutely challenging. Shout out to the Pinnacle Mario LPs. Um, sure. <laughs> Love you, PK. LOL, okay. All right, well, last one was let nice level, nice level PK. Well, there's one thing I've got to do. See, there's a comment he said he would leave on every level that he beat. And now, I'm leaving it. Pinnacle. <laughs> All right, let's see. I finally beat your course thanks to your course builder video. With it. Oh, I need to see that. I actually haven't seen that one. All right, so Bowser's Inferno's done. Swim on Wayward Sun and many. Okay, so at least I'm going to have two completely new ones. Now, this is going to be the first time you guys see me play this because unfortunately there were technical difficulties. And we were missing like the first half of the video. So, yeah, unfortunately, this is going to start off rather simple because I kind of know what you can do. And this level really rewards you for exploring because there are different routes and different things you can do. I uh, don't know why there's just a mushroom shooting out of there, to be perfectly honest. I mean, I guess it's for people that either lose the first uh, fire flower or don't notice it. But here we go. This piece, which right away makes the beginning so much easier for me. And there's actually two things you can do. Uh, one of them is swim under this. 
You kind of just have to go. Now, you have a couple routes. You could go straight up. Or you can go through this, but you have to be fast because the other coins are going to turn back to normal. So that's the route I liked. And then here, get another fire flower, and I got the star, and just make my way up. I just don't remember specifically where I wanted to go with this. I think I just wanted to go forward, and I just done goofed already. Now, he's got those dry bones that go really fast because they got wings. Those are the ones you need to watch out for. That's what makes this level hard uh you just gotta time it uh properly with that and also take advantage of invincibility frames oh like this i guess all right now this part is a little annoying because you gotta hit the bombs back this way without making them hit each other and without hitting them from above so this is a little challenging not gonna lie I don't know if it was intentional to be this annoying, but it is. All right, so, all right, let him go this way. Perfect. Just hit him and let him blow up. Is it because I'm facing this way that they're going this way? So, that just makes it a lot easier, actually. I wasn't even thinking about that. All right, here you got to go. You just got to swim because everything falls so slowly. At first, I thought you actually had to, like, wait for him and then go. But not the case at all. And here, I... This isn't really challenging at all. I don't recall what he wanted... <sighs> uh, I don't recall this part being challenging at all. Boom. Dead. Uh, go me. I'm amazing. All right, let's hurry up and get through here. Find the hidden P block again. Come on. There we go. And let's just go another route. I already showed the bottom route. Let's go this way. Now, uh, I don't think there was anything up here. Oh, yeah, there was. Okay. Oh, shoot. Go, 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 go. Yeah, I'm taking hits. I am taking hits. I think this was the harder route. I don't know if it's any more rewarding. Oh, come on. I would say it's easier because of the P switch, but still. Seriously, this thwomp just decreases the completion rate because you don't think to move right away, boom, you die to the thwomp. Or if you realize too late that there's a question block over here, you die to the thwomp. Oh, geez. Go, 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 go. No, no. Oh, aw. I wouldn't have gotten hit by it. That sucks. All right. Let's go that hard route again. Oh, actually, what's in the middle? I forgot if there was any... Uh, no, I want to go to the... Mm, I still want to go to the top, but... Wait. I'm about to say, you can't break this course, can you? Did I find this out too late? Okay. Just go straight down. Okay, slowly and steady, slow and steady. Ugh. Oh yeah, there's a one up and a star up there. Okay, so that's your reward for going the hard route. Not too worth it, I believe, because if you just take the fire flower and go this way, you can skip the challenging parts by going under. It's a secret, it's just something you gotta explore and find, but I don't know, I like PK's levels. He always asks me, like, for honest opinions and, like, to critique him and all. And I'm like, well, dude, there's probably one thing I don't like. Oh, shoot. That's right. I should have gotten a mushroom. All right, now I'm going to miss that because I'm taking too long. So let's just swim through this way. Right over. How did I? Okay. Did the top or bottom hit me? Because I can't even tell. I can't even tell. That sucks. All right, you come. Come, thank you. That Goomba, the Goomba's being brought down by the Thwomp. That's hilarious. Okay, go, go, go. Turn and go, turn and go. If only I had a P-Switch right now, that'd be great. Just swim even faster with a star. All right, now I think if I can get down here without getting hit, was I just moonwalking? I think I was just moonwalking. Okay, come up. I don't want to get hit by you by accident. I think there's a P-Switch in one of these. No, it's just coins. Hmm. 
Maybe it was here? There it is. See, I knew there was one hidden around here somewhere. I just didn't know specifically where. Now, how the heck? Oh, man. I, I thought there was going to be one more on each side. I just done goofed. I really just done goofed. Le leave me alone. Just leave me alone. Here we go, go. That makes the bomb section a little less annoying. Because you don't have to wait. And go. I got hit by the thwomps. I just got hit by the thwomps. All right, so this part really isn't hard, except like for the spikes. Oh, wait, since when does that hit you? I really don't remember it being like that. I'm completely wrong because I I remember the level incorrectly. <laughs> and obviously I already beat the level, so I would think I'd know what I'm talking about, but apparently I don't remember anything about this level. I remember where some of the hidden P switches are, but that's about it. All right, come on, watch out, watch out. I hate these fish. I hate these fish. I hate these fish with a passion. Let's go. I also hate um, spikes. I don't care if they got goggles and they look a little cute. Just no. All right, you kill yourself. There you go. Ah, stop hitting the star, man. Okay, go, go, go. No, go, go, go. Shoot. See, I'm trying to just get the star late. You've got... <clears throat> okay. Okay. Whatever. Whatever. Apparently, it's not going to work that way. I just want to get the star as late as possible and just swim on, wayward son. All right. At least I'm not going to get hit by this thing this time. I think I should just swim forward. Just not even worry about anything. Just follow this guy. Just go. This is the part where you can't get hit. That's why. Okay. And see, like, here, I think another vine just comes out of the vine, and he just goofed. Or, oh, shoot. Ah, I forgot all about that already. Remember what I said was a little more difficult? Yeah, that right there. Um... Was there a power-up somewhere here? No, there was not. All right, so these guys, you basically have to trigger them to make them uh, kill themselves, or you're going to have not that fun a time. Okay. Sometimes they're just bad at judging the angle that they're going to come at, though. All right. Now, this one won't shoot anymore since I'm right next to it. Just got to wait these out. Oh, okay. That makes that a little easier. All right, avoid you. And avoid you. Oh, the one with the wings already killed itself. All right, then. Didn't see that coming. Gee, I, okay, the level's breaking itself. See, those guys are annoying because of how fast they go. But so far, so good. And the, the funny thing is I'm small. I should be having a whole oh, terrible time. <laughs> That's what I'm talking about right there. I'm going to cut till there because you're swimming. So your momentum is like slow down. I'll just cut till I get back there. Okay. So I got past that section. Now there's a mushroom here. Was there anything else? I don't think so. Okay. So you get one mushroom here just in case you ever messed up. There's a, there's a bunch of stars up there. Jeez. I don't even remember if I can get to that or not. Probably near the end. All right, but here, I think I just used invincibility frames and cheated this section. Yep, yes, I did. And then go, 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 go. And I think the ending is actually like right here. We're getting close. All right, let that go. And let it rise. A little faster would be nice. Okay, go, go, go. Yep, and the ending's right here. Oh yeah, and I trolled the heck out of him and almost died. <laughs> Because I was like, oh, this level's actually really easy. And then he got mad at me for saying that. And then I almost died right at the end. Which he, he was like, I'm, I'm, I'm going to kill you. <laughs> uh, let's see. It took me forever to beat. Mm, forever? Come on now. I mean, it is a long level. I never lost my five. Good job, Ethan. Uh, okay. <sighs> Someone said they're a big fan and... I didn't feel like sitting there and watching all the comments. I'm just curious because 
buddy old pal, old friend. Let me see what uh, people say about you after I've beaten the levels. All right, what was the completion rate? 5.79, that wasn't so bad. This one is under one again. Uh, okay, so the screenshot is just arrows pointing up and platforms you, I, I don't even know. I just see a giant question mark block shape toward the end and nothing else I can really make out. They're just platforms and generic obstacles, not like, not like anything insane. Oh, mm, okay, so I gotta back up and get a real running start. Okay. Okay, and go. Mushroom, oh, one up. Is that to make, is that for 100 uh, Mario challenge if, it, if anyone actually runs into this? Like, oh, you, you done goofed? Well, here's a one-up to make up for that life you lost. Knowing him, it probably is the case. All right, uh, hidden block. Okay, nothing really special there, it looks like. It's just there. See, this actually... Okay, well, I was about to say it kind of looks like it would be an actual Mario 3 level, but... Suddenly, with the P-switches and the blocks, I'm like, nah, probably not. Alright, so let's try to get uh, the P-switch again. Not sure if we need it somewhere. Like, I forgot what this even was. Okay, so there's nothing there. Okay, no big deal. Just take this P-switch, bring it with me. Avoid all this. Alright, so, oh, that's where I need it. Okay. Oh, shoot. Please, please be high enough. Please be high enough. I want this. Mushroom, thank you. Okay, power-ups. Love power-ups. Oh. PK. PK. PK sparks that hotness. How dare you freaking put blocks up there like that? That's cruel. All right, so I just missed that one coin. That's what that was. See, whenever there's just one isolated coin or block somewhere, I forget whether it's, like, for me collecting stuff or if it just appeared there, whatever. Um, I'm pretty sure I've got short-term memory loss. I have to. Like, I, I forget things way too quickly. I must have some sort of memory disability that I've never been aware of my entire life, but only in the past couple years from playing video games. Just, uh, well, I, I forget things way too quick. Then again, it could just because I'm talking and my attention's so divided. All right, what's gonna be in here? That's a bomb. I don't want that. I waited for nothing. Come on, PK. This is starting to become like a trial and error kind of course. Why do I feel like I wanted to go down there instead? Ugh. Oh, God, no. Okay, so we're just gonna let this go. Okay, no, what? Yes, I've still got the P-Switch for absolutely no reason. At least I got this far with the mushroom now. Oh, I should've just gone. Why didn't I just go? Okay, let's not miss this jump now. There we go. Ooh, Firefly. Thank you, Firefly. And this was also uh, implemented way before the uh, update happened, so... Oh man, that would have been nice to use, actually. Why, why, why do I have this still? Get away. All right, what is up here? No! <laughs> all right, so I don't know what all the ringing is for. I kind of ignored that last time, but... Oh, it's so nice having the fire flower now. Now, what's actually in this? Another fire flower, just in case. Good to know, so long as it doesn't despawn. Wait, what? Oh! So it actually would have been a somewhat decent idea to keep the P-Switch all this time. Because then I wouldn't have to deal with these conveyor belts spinning, I wouldn't have had to deal with those bricks and having to blow them up with a bomb. It actually would have been somewhat decent to have that. Oh well. Wouldn't have kept it this far. Okay. Excuse you! It would have been great to have the P-Switch. It would have been amazing to have the P-Switch. Ah, uh, please tell me there's no sp specific way to go. Thank you. Okay. 
Uh, these are probably traps, so I'm just gonna go to the highest one first. Okay, oh, 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 okay. Wait, 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 wait. Can I please get in here and let's not trigger the thwomp anymore? Huh, well, thanks for the accidental one up, I guess. Uh, can I please get up here? I hate th this tiny squeeze right here. It sucks. Okay, what is that? Just coins. Okay. All right, so that's actual Mario Bros. style. Actually putting the hardest, well, the best thing in the hardest place. Or the least convenient place, I guess. Oh, hi, Bowser Jr. How you doing, buddy? I was looking forward to fighting you not. And come on. There we go. Didn't lose the fireballs while he had the fire flower in the last section. Okay. <gasps> okay. Okay. Shouldn't have rushed up there. That was a bad. Thank you, mushroom that I didn't need. Also, once again, I would love to have a P-switch. Now, is there a P-switch up ahead? Oh, no. The bombs. I told PK I hate these things. Why? This isn't challenging. This is just annoying and makes you wait. That's all this is. That's all it is. And if you get hit, it's because you lulled yourself to sleep. <laughs> ah. Okay, let's go, let's go, let's go. Oh, great. Invincibility frames, don't fail me now. Okay. Oh, you've got to be kidding me. Oh, mm, airship, I hate you. I can't see the floor. Oh, well, I can see floor now. See, it's much nicer being prepared for this. Like, I didn't instinctively think, oh, those are going to shoot flames. Ah, uh, but okay. We're all right now. At least I think we are. Okay. Bowser fight. Just don't lose the fire flower. Just don't lose the fire flower. That's all I beg. Don't lose the fire flower this time. Even though I lost the fire flower after the fight, still like, oh, uh, there we go. There we go. Okay. And just be careful because there's flames up here. I'm going to let the flame shoot. Wait, there's two ways. I didn't even notice that. Uh, well, I went up to the right last time. Let's go up to the left. For some reason, I didn't even realize that there were alternate paths. Oh! Oh! I see! If only I didn't get the star first. Wait! Oh my god. Yes! Yes! And the P switch for some reason. Oh, I thought I saw invincibility frames. Well, that's a wasted P switch. Might as well hit it now. Who knows? Come on, move, move, move. Uh, oh. Okay, so now I know that's how you get in the other room and power ups galore. All right, back to the bonus room. And uh, I just need to know. Okay, P switch. That's the fire flower if I want that. Uh, star and no, star and there we go, there we go. And go. No, oh shoot. Okay, go 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 go. Just run, just run. Okay, go go go. As long as I have my star, I'm fine. Okay, go, go. ah shoot. Okay, invincibility frames. There we go. I don't care about having the full power up. I don't need it. I just need it to be big at that point. Okay. Uh, whoa, so many of these. Oh, good thing I jumped. Oh my God, good thing I jumped. I didn't realize that. That's cheap, PK. That's so cheap. You want people to wait for the, sc the screen to fade up just to know that that's there? Come on now. Okay. All right, so, oh, okay. This is the part I was afraid of. Okay. Uh, da -da 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 -da. okay. Oh, shoot. It's funny. I haven't really fought uh, Bowser in the clown car yet in Mario 3. This is a first for me, honestly. At least you keep getting mushrooms. I mean, I would love to have the fire flower instead, but I mean, you get something. Who, who really can't? Come on, Bowser. No, stop being so high. You were too high. And you keep going in your clown car too much. Come on, man. I can't throw up. This isn't fair. Stop going so high. Oh, there we go. 
I'm just gonna keep him with my bombs then. Oh, well, I... Oh, wait, I can't even hit him with... Why was I thinking you could jump on Bowser? Where'd he go? Um... Bowser, you wanna... You wanna come down, buddy? He's stuck. PK? Your course is broken in a bad way. You can't... What happened? He's stuck. He won't come down. He will not come down. I have to redo this whole level because he hit a spike. Where is he? <sighs> um. Wait, PK, I'm stuck. Bowser got that high, real tall. Look, I'm, I'm going to let y'all see. I'm going to let y'all see this. Um, PK, I'm stuck. Bowser got a high. I'm real. I'm really salty. The level's great, but the last part. Yep, there you go. It's over. You gotta restart the level. I'm. I'm. I'm gonna give him a good talking to. I'm gonna give him a real good talking to. Okay, so things are probably gonna go a lot different this time because I actually kept the raccoon tail all the way through. So, I got through uh, most of the level with the star. Well, not the level, but that section anyway. I got through most of that section with the star. Uh, so, I only had one jump to avoid. Now, what if I could just fly over the... Yep, I can. <laughs> stage broken. Not sure if that was intended, but stage broken. Uh, but now I see how... Uh... Wait, hold up, hold up, hold up. Not gonna star that yet. I actually need to go back and look at this because hold up. Like I said, short term memory loss. I don't know what the heck I just saw, but um, oh, it's not even gonna be in there. So I have to download it. Give me a sec. Okay, so um, this is not his fault entirely. Um, technically it is his fault for letting the platforms go that high well okay he has the battle within two different screens but if he goes above this screen all he's gonna do is shoot the bombs because at that point he's not allowed to come back down it's not his fault i doubt he expected that to happen but that's a way that the course is broken and you really can't do anything about it at that point once it's once Bowser goes too high, you lose. So, PK has six stages, right? Um, I'm gonna pretend that I'm the other parent of these courses. The courses are children and I'm the other parent. Um, I'm gonna be the honest parent. <sighs> They're not all winners. Anyway. Oh God, the brutally honest parents are like, hey, they're not all winners. <laughs> But, um, anyway, that's going to do it for PK's Courses Part 1. And we're going to go through the last three in the next episode. So, till then, don't forget to leave a like and a comment if you enjoyed and you want to see more. And, as always, whether or not you've requested it before, go ahead and request other people whose courses you'd like me to do. It can be anybody. As long as I have an ID for one of the courses and I can be told who the heck they are. See... I actually got a response from someone who again said do pyro's course and I'm like okay who is pyro and all they said was it's the top creator on uh mario maker don't quote me on that well I kind of have to quote you on that if that's what you're saying um you need to be a little more specific and then I still never got an id from said pyro so try to be specific about who you want me to play uh and give me an id code if you can Anyway, like I said, like and a comment if you enjoyed, subscribe if you're new, and I will see you in the next video. Goodbye.